Hey everybody, it's Gameragi. We're back with Final Fantasy VII. Last time we saved Yuffie and T uh, not Tifa, Yuffie and Elena from Don Corneo with the help of uh, Reno and Rude. So that was pretty cool. We finally got all our materia back and Yuffie as well. And she was not kidding about scrambling up, uh, or <laughs> they weren't kidding about scrambling up all the materia. That was a pain in the butt trying to rearrange all that stuff again. So, uh, that's what I did. And I also have Yuffie back on the team. So Sid is just gonna take a back seat for now anyway. And hopefully, now we should be able to go into that huge tower now that we have Yuffie with us. Uh, because other than that, I really don't know what else to do right now. <laughs> they might let us shop at some of these stores, though. Actually, I want to check this weapon store. Because they were not letting us do anything before. Listen, I'm sorry about last time. Yuffie told me not to sell anything to you. Yep. Hey, yo, welcome. Some of the best blades right out of the furnace, so strike the <laughs> while the iron's hot. Okay. Wow, you're not kidding at all. Oh my. Look at that. That almost doubles. Uh, oh my. Keep in mind, some of these people, I haven't equipped their new the weapons I have to them yet. Uh, but still, these all look like upgrades like every single one <laughs> and look how many slots they have too oh boy yeah this is happening this is happening I, I don't even care I'm just buying them all except that one because the Dragoon one's really good uh, I can only afford one more Yuffie's got a good one already. Hmm. That's true. Did I equip her new thing to her yet? Let's get Vincent's, because he's cool. Oh, I can't afford it, actually. Oh, whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Everything's so expensive. Uh, I did. I did equip it. Okay. Um... God, that's so much difference, man. That's awesome. Now I have all this crazy stuff. See, I'm filling in the enemy skills. I got three of them now. Uh, let me arrange these really quick. Okay, what do we got? Um, let's give him... Oh, I didn't equip Ram with anybody. There we go. She can have... Uh... Hmm. Don't know. Let's give her exit. She's, she's Miss Magic. Okay. Woo! Holy moly. Exciting times. What was in here again? <laughs> Alright, this is the bar. Uh, maybe I should talk to him, just in case. Eh, screw it. Changed my mind. We're just gonna go to the tower and hope that all is well. Hello. That five-storied pagoda over there is called the Pagoda of the Five Mighty Gods. The five gods are power, speed, magic, war, and omni. Omni has the best of the others. For generations, we in Wutai have worshipped Da Chao, the water god. Legend has it that the village has been protected by Da Chao, the water god, and the five mighty gods. But in the last battle, we didn't fare so well. I guess our beliefs were only based on legend. Oh, you guys are losing your culture because of that loss? That's a bummer right there. 
feel like I should rest in there, in those beds again, but, eh. <laughs> we'll see what happens. This looks like a door. It's like, off color. Hey -o. Oh, Miss Yuffie, will you be climbing the pagoda today? Yeah. That I, Sacred Gorky, will be your opponent on the first floor. Uh, this is a battle tower? Yo, they call me Shake. I'll be watching your fight with Gorky. Then begin. This is a battle tower. Dude. I should have rested. Power change. What are you talking about? Oh, he's this crazy bat thing. Looks like an alien from the movie. And he used a barrier. I should have uh, waited a little bit. Wait, it's just Yuffie? Uh. Wow. Shoot, man. That's not good. <laughs> it's not gonna hurt, is it? A little bit. I don't have D-Barrier on Yuffie. Or heal, or anything. She's getting completely destroyed right now. Oh man, this could be something I have to come back for. Man, if that's the case, I don't know what to do. I guess I could head back to the plane and... Try to go somewhere from there. Kaboosh! Man, Odin is so strong. It's crazy. Oh, no you don't. That's not a good idea. Why did I... Oh, I didn't even think, man. <laughs> I didn't even think. <laughs> bad idea. It's not going to do anything. You dang flying enemy. Alright, I guess I'll just attack it. Um, or heal myself. That would be preferred. Demi too. Oh god, landscaper. I hope that's not a ground-based attack. Oh god, it is. That stinks. Taking a lot of risks right now. <laughs> I should use an X potion. Is it, why is it so far down? I should like rearrange my items. God, this thing hits so hard. It keeps regenning. Stop it. Okay, I'll get heal again. <laughs> Ow. Uh, hurry! What was that? He used his skill to power up? That's not cool. Shoot, I used it again. Well... See, that's the thing. Like, when I get a limit break, I can't do a normal attack. I can use magic on it, I guess. Too. Really wish I had that D barrier spell right now. Hmm. This is tough. This is a tough battle right here. <laughs> Shoot.
Kaboosh. Why is it powering up? Attack me. Uh huh. Man, that stinks. That limit break is ground based. Come on, you dang alien. Just die, would you? And I don't know how much health it has. It could have like thousands and thousands. I wouldn't even know. <laughs> Ooh, nice crit. Just keep going, Yuffie. Getting lots of hits. Okay, that's enough. Oh god, I'm dead. I'm not- uh, oh man, two health? I'm so screwed right now. I'll use my dang limit break again. It's a cool looking attack, I just wish it could actually hit this enemy. <laughs> Unless there's a way to change your limit level in, in battle. Oh yeah! Get on, alien! Okay, I'm not moving to the next floor. That That's tough enough for me, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> Here I am, Miss Yuffie. Here I am? Of course. Hmm, I thought you were just a girl, but you're, you handled that pretty good. See how you do on the next one. Here I am, Miss UV. Why are you saying that? That's weird. Okay, yeah, I can't, I can't. That was hard enough. <laughs> I don't think I'm ready for the second floor just right now. Shoot. I don't know where to go from here, guys. I could get back in the plane and try to explore around, but... Man, I really don't know. Who's in here? I forgot. Oh, this is the item shop. Yeah, that's right. Okay, I'm gonna save again. We're gonna go out here and take a looky-loo at the map -aru. Hopefully I can get some indication of where I'm headed. Rufus said they were going the wrong way, so... That leads me to believe. Uh, the background is really messing with my map. Okay, let's see here. Our plane's all the way in the southern part of this continent. <laughs> I've traveled just about everywhere on that continent and that one. I believe. So maybe it's in the northern continent? Like, maybe I could get there with my plane? If there's enough shallow water connecting them, I could. Hmm. There really isn't much left of this map in terms of the, you know, the dots that I can go to. It's crazy to me. Hmm. Okay, I guess I'm gonna head back to my plane. Uh, I suppose I should check over here first, though. Just to make sure there's nothing up here. Some really crazy land masses in this world. <laughs> it's just a pointy end. Okay. Alright, I'm going back to the plane, then. Man, it sure feels good to have all my materia back. Because those things increase your damage and stuff, too. Oh boy. This is quite the journey. Oh 
I wonder if I could have gotten here with the point. Man, here goes Tifa's super limit break. Beat rush. Somersault. Oh man. Oh, water kick. Keeps going. Meteor drive. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Holy cow. She did so much damage. That's insane. I'm still getting lots of Phoenix Downs from these guys, that's awesome. So yeah, I was wondering if I could get the plane over here, but it looks like uh, it gets kind of skinny on this side, so... Oh! There's a cave over there! Hello, hello? Is that where I want to go? Maybe so. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it definitely looks like I could get there. Maybe. Well, there's no beach to land on, so maybe not. Jeez, there's so much I could explore. Oh my god. And then I never checked down here either, so... Maybe I should... Look around, look around. Chocobo tracks. In case I needed one. Lots of chocobo tracks. Hmm. Yeah, that looks like about it. There's my uh, plane over there. So, okay. Cool. <laughs> when do I get to own a chocobo? I want. I want to own one, dude. Wow. Hello, Adamant Taimai. This could be a really scary thing. Uh, the turtles in the other game, Final Fantasy XIII, were like ridiculous. And like the hardest enemy in the entire game. Maybe I should sense on this thing. Yeah, I'm a little afraid of this. Hang on. <laughs> Jeez. For a turtle, it sure attacks a lot. Uh, what? Level 30. Alright. Oh, no, that's not too bad. How's that barrier, though? Flamethrower on it. It's probably a water enemy, so that's probably not a good idea, but I just want to see. <laughs> Flamethrower. Look, he's got like a katana now. That's so cool. Yeah. What are you, what are you up to? Oh. God, it's so scary looking. Actually, let's. Barrier. Oh, wait, I don't want a cast barrier. I want a D barrier. Oh, that's a magic barrier. Okay. Hey, what happened to your barrier, dude? I like how it doesn't say anything was removed, so I have no idea if that even worked. <laughs> I guess it did. Okay, that uh, turtle's a lot less scary in this game. In 13, it'll just, like, stomp you and you're dead. Well, sorta. Of. Unless you are really high level. Boy. I, like, I kinda wish they had given me some hint of where to go. Cause I'm pretty sure this whole Yuffie thing was, like, some sidetrack. Uh... It's, like, all completely optional so story going on. <laughs> I'm back in the plane! 
And I can't save while I'm in the plane. Hang on, let me just save really quick. Okay, now then. Let's see where we can go. Let's just check up here, I guess. Please no random battles, please no random battles. I want to explore my leisure. See, there's a cave right there, but I can't... There's no beach to land on. So... Remember for later. I could land here. And that's where, uh... The rocket town is. Seems like we need to fix this plane up, you know? I'm really glad there's no random battles going on right now. And this island looks really suspicious. There's probably something really crazy you fight on there. <laughs> Hello? Oh, that's the same town. Whew. So many places to go, dude. Okay. Hoping these continents connect with some shallow water. Ooh, frozen land to the north. And it looks like they do connect. Um, just want to look around here. Okay. Oh boy. Here we go. <laughs> yup. This looks like where I need to go. Just gonna do some more browsing though. Uh, let's go back to Midgar. Dude, there's Midgar right there. I could go back. I think that's Midgar. Looks like it. Wow, that's crazy. I don't want to go back there right now. Okay, land to the north. That's my plan. It's a very scary plan. Uh, we'll see if this is a good idea or not. Okay, skeleton in the bushes. Hello. Welcome to Bone Village, a town for nature lovers. What do you want? Have you seen Sephiroth? Oh, the man in the black cape. He was looking for the Temple of the Ancients. Where's that? It's way down south. It's on the other side of this town, and the Inland Sea. Wait, what? It's down south. It's on the other side of this town, and the Inland Sea? Okay. It's a pyramid rising out of the forest. How do you get in? You need the Keystone. What's a Keystone? <laughs> Just like it sounds, a rock that's a key. I heard that some rich guy has it. Rich guy? Uh, that could be any number of people. And I really like this fighter jet that's like crashed into this huge skeleton. That's really cool looking right there. Surprised nobody's cleaned it up since they made a town out of this place. Wanna buy something? Maybe. You really gonna do that to me? Didn't I just buy a whole bunch of gold things? Hmm. I can't afford that many. But I can't afford three. That's really all I need, I guess. Woo boy. These guys have fury. Hmm. I gotta equip more materia now. Oh boy. Well, I know. I know what I want to give uh, Yuffie. I want her to have steel. Tifa, you can have. I don't know. 
some attacking magic, maybe? How about gravity? Sure. <laughs> Cloud, you can have, uh... Death blow. Sure. Okay, so I need the keystone from some rich guy. That could be Dio, that could be Rufus. That could even be Don Corneo, but I... I don't know. Looks like they're... Excavating the bones here. That's pretty neat. Nature lovers. You can awaken the sleeping forest if you have the lunar harp. Once awake, they say the forest will open a road for you. Okay, that sounds like I probably need that. We use the newest system to find buried treasure. We use bombs to make earthquakes, and then check the sound waves given off by the tremors. You sure you guys are nature lovers? Excava excavating is a slow process. The treasures we excavate are stored in the box next to that next to the tent. Remember that. Really? This box? Hmm. I want to see the treasures. This is the box, right? Huh. The forest just beyond here is called the Sleeping Forest. Right now, the forest is asleep. Anyone who wanders in while it's asleep gets confused. You can go in, but you may never come out. That doesn't sound like a good thing to be doing without a lunar harp. Unless I could find the harp in there? Well, I saved. Might as well try. <laughs> oh god. Just keep going, Cloud. I need the lunar harp. You can tell already. I don't want to get stuck in another desert thing. Alright, we're gonna head out now. Look at that, instantly back. Yep. I think it's pretty obvious what I need to be doing here. <laughs> okay, so I gotta find the lunar harp somewhere. Should be fun. Can I talk to this lady? Nope. Did I open this box? Maybe this is a box they were talking about. Where they find put all the new treasures. What are you doing? Excavating is great. It's like a history of the planet told in the land. Yep, pretty much. Okay. So what do we got going on? Huge crevice. And a weird thing in the middle of it. In the world is that? Doesn't look like I can get to it though. Okay. Hmm. Well, that's that's pretty much all I can do here. <laughs> so rich guy, rich guy. We know where to go. Oh, that must be the inland lake, that big crevice. So I probably have to make my way through the sleeping forest to get to the Temple of the Ancients where Sephiroth is supposedly hanging out. So the rich guy is either Rufus or Dio. Those are my two hunches. Uh, and since Midgar is so close, Rufus might be there. I mean, that's where his headquarters is. Uh, 
Yeah. So... Shoot, man. I have no idea. Where does this go? This is cool. I can go, like, all the way around the continents, pretty much. This looks newish. How did I, um... It's uh, an overhead view. Forgot about that. Uh... That's that town of Calm over there. Mm. So many places to go right now. Yeah, I don't know if I have ever been on this side of the hill before. I don't think there's anything there. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, I gotta end this part. So... Hmm... I can go up rivers? Well, sort of. I guess next time we'll uh, go back to Midgar and maybe something will trigger. I really don't know. Rufus and, and Dio are the only rich people I can think of that would they might be referring to. So, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> next time we'll go back to Midgar see what's going on. If nothing's going on, then uh, go back to the Gold Saucer, I guess. Not entirely sure what else I can be doing right now. So, yeah. See you guys next time.